so, mm -hmm. Mr. Johnson, um, is it is with regards to the report by uh, Mr. Sewell? Um, as you know, I, I, I'm from the black community, and we find it quite offensive that such a report was written, taking on board that the previous reports, like the McPherson reports, blah, 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 de, blah, de, blah, were not acted on because there was hundreds of recommendations that could be made. Well, no, no, thank you very much, Akin Adewale, for coming along today. I hope I pronounced your name correct. It's a bit of a tongue twister, so it is. I mean, that's not completely correct. We implemented the Femis and Ferguson support in relation to what happened 20 years ago, and we made huge strides. I mean, back in 2001, we had no ethnic minority MPs. Now, 20 years later, we have more than 22. Uh, you know, Savit Javid, the first black chairman of the non-political party, uh, you know, a, a Muslim cabinet, Saeed Wasi, and, and even the first black Asian secretary, unsecretary that is, Miss <laughs> uh, Pretty Patel. So I think we've come a long way, I disagree. Uh, I would like to address some of those comments you made earlier. Um, the report was ill-informed. And you know, you talk about having a diverse cabinet, but yes. your cabinets seem to be made up of Asians. Now they're not exactly what we consider the black the black majority. Well, well, my, my only answer to that is, is the fact that is whether the, the the people of color actually you know went came forward and and um, applied for the post. The, 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 that that's, that can't be helped. That's not down to myself. The door is open for everyone. Uh -huh. I put it to you, sir, that the report is a token gesture. It fails to, to build upon the previous reports, such as the most recent reports, yeah. where it talks about institutional racism within the UK, you know, disparity of, you know, housing, mental health, the criminal justice system, you know, we, we have police been, brutality, uh, stop and search, uh, all that had an impact on the black people of, of Britain. Well, I, I what say you, sir? Me. I have to disagree with you. Uh, you know, it's in relation to stop and search, stop and search is, is has proved is proved to reduce crime on crime and and black crime in the community. The knife crime has gone down because of uh, stop and search. We have a lot of professional uh, um, mental health workers in in in, in the NHS. Oh, that, that please, pardon? Spare me the sentiment. I mean, the, the stop and search is a racist tool used uh, by the police to target innocent young black men. I disagree. We, and we, women. We, it is community led in places such as Cornwall, such as Brighton, the, 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 ethnic, the ethnic authority is mainly white and more whites are actually stopped and searched in places like Cornwall and Brighton as they are in Brixton, which is Brixton is more of a black orientated environment. It just goes to show where the environment it is, is where the people are, is where the stop and search will be. It's not black on black at all. I disagree. What, what evidence has shown that statistically black people are more than nine times more likely to be stopped and searched by the police, more likely to be in inpatient mental health care, more likely to suffer academically within the educational system. And of course, we all know about the criminal justice service, service which you and the wind, wind rush scandal which your predecessor um was a, was the home secretary at the time and your recent yes. home secretary mr patel yes you know fails to act i'm they're still waiting for compensation we have after, we have, we after have. it was your tory government that put in the hostile environment how could the report says that there's no such thing as structural racism in the uk there is no such thing as structural racism in the in the UK. We have made huge strides over the last twenty years, and in in part of in, in relation to Europe, we are the most diverse uh, country in the whole of Europe that has embraced people of colour. You know the, the the BAME community, as they call it. Yeah, you know? uh, and as for the wind rush, we actually apologise for the wind rush, which I might tell you was before my time. Same same conservative government, same policies that you are, are upholding. 
It may have been the same Conservative government, but that was in 1941. I cannot be held accountable for things that happened before I was even born. Come on. But you could have made the change. You could have made changes, Johnson. We have made changes. That's why Priti Patel is the Home Secretary of of Colour. We have Sammy Jackson, who is of colour. Nafi Shepard, who is of colour. Half of the cabinet is made up of colour. What more do you want? I mean, if you want black people to come in, then they have to apply for the job like everybody else. (laughs) <laughs> yeah, I find it hard to keep a straight face. <laughs> that's really, that's really, yeah. Yeah, I think if we keep the dialogue like that, back and forth, yeah? yeah. Um, <laughs> back, back and forth. I just think I just need to add in, so I don't know where Tony sees this interview part going in. Um, well, bearing in mind, I'm in the first two scenes. Obviously, I'm not in the father scene. I'm in the family scene. And then after the family scene, it goes into the bank scene, isn't it? Yeah. And you're also in the bank scene. So the only way yeah. I could see it fitting in in order for me to do my costume changes, etc., would be um, after would be after the family scene, because then I'm not in the very, very beginning of the bank scene, and I only come in at the end of the bank scene. And that will give you time to maybe change your hat or whatever, I don't know, yeah? Yeah. That, because if I'm, otherwise I'm doing three, I mean, three different scenes directly after each other. Yeah, um, yeah, yeah, okay. So, so in a sense of slotting it in, that's the only place where I could see it um, being during the, the, the the show bit um mm-hmm. but uh yeah i mean listen you bombard me with all those questions because i haven't got a leg to stand on basically but i'm still going to justify yeah, yeah. by saying if you don't apply for the job no matter what color that's your problem mate um yeah yeah so, yeah, yeah so uh okay yeah 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 i just need to look at yeah maybe i need, I need to put the words out that the audience are expected to hear like structural racism yes um yeah and yeah tony tony sewell they got here is a token expression of black achievement tony who tony sewell the author yeah. i just spell his last name S E W E W L. He's a black author, yeah. Pardon? He's a black author, yeah. Yeah, yeah. He's the yeah. He's, he's the author. Oh, he's the author of of, of the this commission. That's the report, there. yeah, yeah. Oh, he's oh. Uh, yeah. Okay. Um, yeah, we've even got an Asian. It's strange because there are a lot of Asians and Muslim um, in the government. There aren't that many black. Uh, yeah, no, they're not. They're not. Um, and uh, they're not indeed. Not indeed. You know, but hopefully things will change in the future. Um, yeah. Uh, The win- so I need to look at the winning brush report. You'll have to get yourself a blonde wig if you had time. Um, I do have a wig. It's um, not blonde as such. It's um, it's kind of brown, but I do I do have one which um, I'm which I'll get from when we start at five. But it's not to hand at the moment. Yeah, I've got my wig, and I'll put on a stupid Boris suit. And some um, and some funny glasses. 
but uh, and a scruffle shirt, but he's such a scruff. Man can't yeah. Even, he can't even dress properly. Um, the Duchess of Sussex. Isn't that Megan? Yes, yes. Oh yeah, I can throw that in there. We had the first first minority, ethnic minority in within the Royal Party is our Megan. Yes, so we have come a long way. What you're talking about? We're talking potatoes, you can wash. Mm. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Then I can come back with that one with the um with the fact that the royal family was more concerned of the colours, the, the, the colour of this the colour of the baby being born. Yeah, well, this, that was just basically to see, but this would be a boy or girl, the scheme, where they're going to do the, the, the color, color of the nursery. That's what it was. Make a stomach out of nothing. We... <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, dear. Uh... Yeah. I'm um, to see what else is here. Yeah, 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 sure. Um, you know, black people feel let down by the report. How do they feel let down by the report? The report has come a long way. Of course, it has. In twenty years, we have more people of colour in in this in this fantastic city called London than we have ever had. You know, in the last twenty years, you've had more black people in prison, incarcerated, and in the mental health system than you have ever had. That's because they committed more offences. <laughs> because they was targeted by the racist conservative policies. I disagree. Well, well, when Labour was in power, there were more. There was less less support for for single parents, for 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 people of color, color, for all kind of people of education. The conservatives have come a long line of austerity and of oppression, and we have made certain things. And yes, we have to be tough. You know, we're tough on crime and tough on the causes of crime, and clearly it worked. You know, we're stopping we're stopping uh, migrants coming over in their in their boats, but it's very difficult. A racist uh, policy, a racist policy, because a lot of them are coming from war-torn countries. Well, they should stay in France. That's part of the treaty. That's why I opted to come out of Brexit so that we could stop that happening. And never racist policy, because you feared of the Britain, this great Britain, was going to be overrun and swamped with foreigners. Well, I'll put it to you, sir. And foreigners can be of all colours, not just of black or BAME, as we call it. You know, I'm going to write a song and do a song about the BAME community. However, yes, we, we have made, we have to, we have to protect our borders. And if people want to come into this country, they need to bring their skills with them. You know, we just can't sit around and, and, and pay for people to be on benefits, you know, whether they're of color or not, you know, get up and get- A get lot, a lot of the black people and Asian people in this country have a lot of skills to offer. A lot of these skills are being totally ignored because of the color of their skin. And because you have a, a, a large majority of people who feel threatened by people who are non-white. I disagree. I just feel that they maybe when they come here, uh, those, those who are non-UK non citizens come here and think that we are a handout. We are a soft country. Well, we have to be tough. And those that are the UK citizens, they need to get up off the backside and go and get a job. It's as simple as that. Whether you're black, white, and that green, is or right. And that is why you created your hostile environment. It's not it's a hostile sure. environment. The, 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 it the, is a hostile the, environment. <laughs> Penn Downing Street is open to all. Anyone with any kind of ambition can apply for the same post. And if they think they can do the job better than me, whether you're black or green, go forth and multiply. Maybe not. That's what I do with all the women I have sex with. <laughs> anyway. Yes. 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 Well, you know, the, the, the black people I have spoken to feel let down by your cronies' reports. See, as a token, just into the to to the community, it fails to we'll talk about the structural racism that, and it's tokenistic and laughable. You know, you you talk about the windwash. You know, you put in a hostile environment in place, and it affected the Afro Caribbean community the most. Who came here on the calling of your then 
member of parliament, Enoch Powell, who then went on to state the river of blood. Yes, and for that we have a Apologize. I mean, come on, guys. If you guys keep got move thinking about the past, we're never going to move on, are we? You know, the wind rush happened. It was a mistake. We've said sorry. We've paid out millions and millions in compensation. Yeah, we've even you haven't paid out. How much have you paid out to date? We have housed people. We have given people their blue. <laughs> the UK passports, and we've got to move on. We've got to move on. You guys keep living in the dark ages. Oh, did I say that word? Sorry. You guys keep living in the past, and, and all that's going to do is breed the gentleman. This report is actually bigging up the people of Bain rather than putting them down. Let's just move forward. I mean, this is ridiculous. Of course it is. I, 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 I would prefer if you didn't use the, the term Bain. It's quite offensive. Well, well, uh, how is that offensive? It's, it's a word that's used regularly amongst all, all people of colour. So, ah, ah, but the word, but the word "bane" actually stands for black and ethnic minorities. Now you could be an Australian and be an, a minority, but you could be Australian and white and still and still have white privilege. Right. Okay. So we're we're very referring to people of color, black people. Yes. Okay, I yes. will say black people, not Bain people, because if you're feeling offended, the last thing I, as a prime minister of this country, want to do is, is ostracize and make anybody of color, right? Because black lives may, may, matter. May I, may I refer you to the time when you described um, Muslim wearing, wearing hijabs as letter boxes? <laughs> that was, that was off the cuff, off the cuff remark that was said uh, off record. And, and again, again, you know, it's everyone's just so PC and has, and they've got a chip on their shoulder. It was a little wise remark said off the record. Okay. You know, I mean, you've got to scrutinize me, the prime minister, for every single word that comes out of my mouth. That's hogwash. Yes. You, you, you're supposed to lead by example. Well, yes, I lead by example because I have a sense of humor. You know, what, what, why is it the people of colour, the black community, have got this, this chip on their shoulder? I mean, 50 years have gone by. We have, we have, I have many people of colour in the Conservative government. I have people, I have the, the Mayor of London is a man of colour. I have people in education, in health, in administration, even in, I even have black farmers. Come on, we did have black farmers 30 years ago, didn't we? Move on. Yeah, I like that. I like that. I like that. Uh, dear. Okay. Uh, um, I'm just. I'm just reading some of the stuff. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. But, but, guy, and I raised the point in 2017, your predecessor, Theresa May, you know, um, there was a report with recommendation, the race disparity audit, um, nothing was done by it. In 2017 also, the Lamry review found evidence of, of bias and discrimination against people from ethnic minority backgrounds in the justice system. You know, also in 2017, which are we looking about four years ago, you know, the McGregor Smith review about racism in the workplace, you know, are disadvantaged and face lower, lower employment rates than the white counterparts. How do you answer that? It's, it's and, the, oh, and, and of course, the Windwash scandal, institutional ignorance and thoughtfulness about race. I put it to you, sir. The Conservative government is institutional ignorant. I totally- And racist. I, you know, I would love to agree with you. And, and you, you call it apple and apple or a pear a pear. Uh, it's, it's just so far from the truth, as I've explained. And I'm not going to keep going over it over the same thing. I've explained. Look at even sport. We have got we have got people of colour, British World Championships that are, are, are black. We've got the former championship 
racer, Lewis Hamilton, he's also black. We have loads of black people that have achieved far more than their counterparts who have all also, who are white, who have who've had more, who've had a kind of handout. So what are you talking about? I just don't see it. And, I, and out of all those black people you've rescued, you've mentioned, every single one of them have in the last 12 months or from day one they entered the world of sport have received racist comments racist language and be targeted professional footballers lewis hamilton marco you know the very old marcus rashford who you know suffered a, a horrendous abuse so that is why we as the black people feel let down by the report and we would like you to repudiate the report commission a brand new one somebody independent somebody respected within the black and asian community who know what they're talking about well, rather than panda panda to the conservative government Everybody on the board or the panel that created this report, bar one person, was of colour. Hello. The report was... And who, were, and, and who were they selected? And they were selected by the government. Why not have a cross-party? They have the their own mind. It was it's totally independent of the government, and everyone, bar one, was of colour. So how can you say that this report is biased when he was completed by people of colour? Where did you get this man from? Oh, God. <laughs> Where did you come from? It's, 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 it's preposterous. It is preposterous that we have a prime minister like such a yourself in power. Uh, uh, well, and I think, I, I think on that we should end it because that's, that's a really good thing to end on. What was that? What do you reckon? <laughs> what was it? What was it? What was it? What did I say? What did you say? When you said it is preposterous that I should be talking like that, and I and I said to you, it is preposterous that we should have a prime minister like you in the first place. I love you. Yeah. Okay, well, you know what? Thank you very much. That's that's all from the cabinet. Same time next week. Well, who did you get this man from? It's pathetic. <laughs> yeah. But cool. Yeah, yeah. We just yeah. got. Uh, we just got to. Uh, I think if we. Sorry. Go on. No, yeah, I was just going to say we've just got. To, um, also, yeah, be mindful of the three minutes. But yeah, because there's so much there you can throw at me. It's unbelievable. I think it's bam, bam, bam. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. If we just continue to like bat it back and forth, keep saying that I keep saying the same thing. I would mention about the previous reports. Yeah, yeah, and then you keep stumbling after everything, and you trying to justify everything. And then when you say it's absolutely preposterous that you should think of a, such a notion, then that's my cue to say, okay, last sentence, and then we're off. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, that's fine. I mean, like I said, I'm, I'm going to do my very best to avoid every single answer by saying, yeah, we've got Floella, Floella Benjamin, who's now um, an MP. Da, da, da. She's a really good at doing what she was doing, a magic wonder about or, or whatever it was called. Yeah, I'll just find some nonsense to just counteract what you're talking about. And it's flawed. Yeah. 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 Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I think we need to keep it tight to three minutes or or so. Or just under. Yep. Yeah. Um, okay. I'm sure that uh, when anything we... else? Anything else do you think? No, 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 no. What you what you say is good. I mean I'd say you're gonna throw the art questions at me. I'm gonna do my very best to divert the answers um as 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 best I can under the Yeah. 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 Cool. Mm-hmm. Okay. That's it. All right. I'm yeah. gonna have something to eat now. And I'll see you back at five, yeah? Yeah, no problem. I'll see you in a little while. Thank you, Lloyd. Yeah. All right. Yeah. All right. Thanks so much. Yeah. Thanks. Bye. Bye.